Hey, this is Brett, and this 2016 Dodge Challenger Hellcat is stock number 14449Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used sports car and Dodge Challenger headquarters. This 2016 Dodge Challenger Hellcat has the 6.2 liter V8 Hemi engine. It is supercharged and puts out 707 horsepower with the red key. This car has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop per the state of Wisconsin inspection process. It has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. This car is 100% ready to go. Super clean all the way around. That's exactly what I'm gonna do in this video. Go all the way around inside, start it up, take a look under the hood, show you all the options, listen to that exhaust, and just give you the most accurate representation that I can of the vehicle. Ivory white tri-coat metallic is the color I shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications, and get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube and stay current on our ever-changing and vast sports car inventory here at Summit Automotive. This one comes with the Brass Monkey 20-inch painted alloy wheels, and it has, of course, the Brembo brakes with the slotted rotors. Pirelli, Pirelli P0 275-40ZR20 tires on here. These tires have a pretty good amount of tread left. I'd say probably 50 50-60% of the tread left on those tires. I didn't see any scuffs or scrapes on that wheel. Front fender is in excellent condition. I didn't see any dents or dings on there. Looks really good. Coming around the front here, lower valence and bumper all look very good. Didn't see any scuffs or scrapes. Looks pretty nice. Has the HID headlamps, the LED running lights, you get the wrapped hood with the two heat extraction and center cowl induction. That's my favorite hood on the Challengers. And I didn't see any dents or dings on there. Looks really good. Passenger side front fender is in excellent condition as well. And the passenger side front wheel, no major scuffs or scrapes on there. Ivory white tricoat metallic's got a lot of metal flake in it. A lot of pearl. Really a cool color, especially in the sunlight. This thing really shimmers. Once again, down this side of the vehicle, front fender is in great shape, and down the rest of this side, doors look really good. Didn't see any dents, I didn't see any dings, I didn't see any major scratches or anything like that. Passenger side rear quarter looks good. I take these HD videos, so if you're far away, or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the car, hear the car, and have confidence in what you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, it was helpful and that Brett sent you. Back wheel is in excellent shape as well. You get the Brembo brakes back here too. And the back tires have just as much tread as the front tires. Coming around to the back of the vehicle, rear bumper's in great shape. You do get the dual rear exhaust, of course. Backup parking sensors, LED tail lamps, and of course the deck lid spoiler. The trunk lid itself, very nice and clean, no dents or dings on there. Back here, you do get a car cover, which is a pretty nice feature. You also get the Harman Kardon premium sound system with the subwoofer tire inflator kit, and that's where your battery is located. You can see those shocks are doing a nice job holding that trunk lid up. Always something you want to look at on these Challengers. Make sure that those shocks are good. Coming around the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side. No major dents or dings over here. And for full disclosure, this back wheel is just as nice as the rest. And down the rest of this side of the car, the door looks really good. Hellcat logo looks really good. You get the blind spot monitoring, heated mirrors, enter and go system. And my favorite option on the Hellcats, besides the engine of course, is the Laguna leather. So these are full leather seats. You get the SRT embossed in the backrest, no rips, no tears. It's really a soft touch leather. Really a nice, nice feature. Power driver's seat, 
factory floor mats, you do get auto headlamps, power tilt and telescopic steering wheel. That's working nicely, power windows, locks and mirrors. Uh, you get the Laguna leather on the bolster there as well. Take a quick look at the back seats. They're trimmed out the same way. This one does have the red seat belts. Latch child safety system, no rips, no tears. Smells very clean inside this car. Hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this one has to offer on the interior. 10,691 miles, you get the Hellcat animation at the beginning there. Digital speedometer range to empty. You can change all those corners to read pretty much whatever you want. Instrument cluster is very nice and clean and do note the kind of machine metal look around the dash instrument cluster there. Has the leather wrapped heated steering wheel. Cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, audio controls in the back of the steering wheel, and then of course you get your paddle shifters there. This one has the 8.4 3C radio. You get the factory navigation system, does take a second to load up. So while it's loading, oh there we go. While it's loading you get AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities, and then you get your factory navigation system. There is Highway 41, so that is working nicely. Another thing you always want to check to make sure that uh, where you're at is where the navigation system says you're at. Uh, just in these challengers, it has been known to not work. This one is working perfectly. You get your heated and cooled seat buttons as well as your heated steering wheel controls. Then you get all your different apps on here, including the drive modes and then the performance pages, which take a second to load as well. And while all that stuff is loading down here are the more tactile volume tune and climate controls, including those dual climate controls, your eight speed automatic transmission uh, with the center console shifter there. Keyless entry with the remote start. And the key fob itself is in really nice condition. Passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition as well. Once again, smells very clean inside this car. I don't think it's ever been smoked in. And this one does have the power sunroof, which is a very nice feature. As well, you get your map lights and home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems and your sunroof controls there. 911 and assist buttons there as well. Here are your performance pages. You get your timers on there. You get your gauges, G-force, and then your engine. It's obviously not doing anything right now, but if the car was started, uh, that would look different. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm going to remote start the car from the back so you can hear it start up and then we will take a look under the hood all right i'm gonna press lock it and then press this button twice sounding V8 engine. Now we do have to officially start the car before we can take a look under the hood, so I just gotta put my foot on the brake and start it like so. And you can see there are no check engine lights or anything like that. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video you've been able to verify the quality, condition, options, and of course cleanliness of this car all the way around inside. Now you got those HID headlamps there, LED running lights. They are very bright and working nicely. Under the hood we have the 6.2 liter supercharged V8 Hemi engine. 707 horsepower with the red key engine base very clean runs very smooth once again this car has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop as a fresh oil and filter change all the fluids have been checked and topped off this car is 100 percent ready to go there is the emissions sticker shocks are doing a great job holding that hood up 
and I would highly recommend this car from a quality and condition standpoint. I think whoever's gonna get this one's gonna be very happy with it. And to see more pictures of this car or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, Challengers, Chargers, Mustangs, Corvettes, Camaros, any sports car you want, you name it, we got it. Go to the website right there at summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle all at summitauto.com. If you want to check out more HD videos, you can get, go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and sports car walkarounds on YouTube. And stay current on our ever-changing and vast sports car inventory here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Dodge Challenger videos I've ever done in the upper right, link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to be offering this ultra-clean 2016 Dodge Challenger Hellcat and Ivory White Tricoat Metal. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again. Have a great day.